Hi guys, this is Sneaky. Welcome back. I'm coming on here um, to finish up the Rite Aid deals that I did this week. If you watched the last video, it was showing that I needed $27 more to get my 2,000 points. And I did tell you guys that I had $20, which equals to 2,000 points at Rite Aid. And the $5 Catalina from the last transaction at Rite Aid. Okay, these are the 8 mega rolls. Equals to 12 rolls of paper towels. That's a great deal within itself. Okay, and they are $6.99 at Rite Aid right now. And a part of the starting points. So, like I said earlier, I needed $27 more dollars to um, get my other 2,000 points. So four of them equals to $27.96. And I had four of the 55 cents off printables, which brought my total down to $25.76. And I used the 2,000 points from the last transaction. That's in the other video for this week from Rite Aid. So I used that $20. And I also used the $5 Catalina that I got in my previous transaction so I paid 76 cent plus tax for four large packages of paper towels 76 cent plus tax and then I got back my $20 which equals to 2,000 points because I completed the spend 50 get 20 and that was a limit of two so it's like you spend a hundred and get 40 so, yes, I got that $20 back, and I also got that $5 Catalina back. So, I have a total of $25 for my next transaction at Rite Aid on that card. Yes, guys, this is a great, great deal that's going on at Rite Aid this week. And I've overheard someone say that... Um, it's like the out of pocket is a little high. But this is just the same as like your CVS, Rite Aid, Target. Uh, if you don't have any store money, store credit, just when you have extra monies, put back um, the initial out of pocket. Spend it wisely. Like go in the stores like this deal here. This is a great deal. This is a great time to store. You know, to spend 50, get 20. What you would do is get your coupons and you will pay out of pocket that first time and you will roll your money from then on. Like this $25 for this card, I'm going to keep that for next week. And you just keep rolling. That way you won't have a big out of pocket. And see what I'm working on right now. Like I said, I just re recently started shopping back at Rite Aid. I used to shop there years ago, but I just started back. And so what I'm working on right now is trying to get to gold. I'm trying to get to gold. That way I will have um, an extra, what is it, 20% off everything in the store. Yes, I am trying to get to that point. But... Uh, like I said, if you don't shop or have a Rite Aid, just take that first first initial out of pocket and just keep rolling your points from one week to another um, the same way as we do at CVS or, you know, Walgreens and Target. You know, you can buy things that give you gift cards at Target and just keep those gift cards and just keep rolling into weeks after weeks and Continue to get the gift cards back or the store credit, store money. But yes, this is what I did um, last couple of weeks at uh, Rite Aid. That's how I have not been able, you know, didn't have to pay much, much out of pocket on the transactions that I was telling you guys about. And the same goes for CVS. But yes, guys, this is it for now. I just wanted to come on here and let you know about this deal and tell you about the 
me wrapping Rite Aid, wrapping the deals up at Rite Aid this week. Um, please like, share, subscribe, comment down below if you have any questions.